Hello and welcome back to the Golf Studio here at St Anzo Links for another edition of this week's news. Okay, so it's a big week. Tiger is back. Yes, Tiger Woods is going to be playing golf again and we've seen some footage, seen some images of him already. He looks like he's swinging well, he's striking it well. Brad Faxon apparently has come out and said he's hitting it further than Justin Johnson and Jason Day. Well, that will be left to be believed uh, this Thursday and Friday playing in his own tournament. Yeah, Tiger hosts the Hero World Challenge and our very own Tommy Fleetwood will be playing as well. Great to see Tommy involved. But certainly, I know full well I'll be watching. Tiger Woods, love him or hate him, but great to have him back in the game. Do you think he's going to make the cut? Tell me what you think. Tell me your scores. Personally, I hope he makes the cut. I hope he has a good event. I don't feel like he would have played unless he didn't think he'd win it. It's been a long time recovering. But certainly from my behalf, we wish him well. On that note, we do have a very limited, very rare Tiger Woods driver here. This is the TW Nike Vapor driver with the exact same spec that Tiger was using when he was playing Nike. We do have one of those left in store at St. Anzo Links. If you're interested and you want to make a purchase, message me, send me, a couple of in uh, send me some information and we'll come back to you. Uh, you may notice now Tiger is playing TaylorMade. He's using the M2 driver. Off the top of my head, I think it's last year's, may have changed to this year's, I'm not sure, but we'll see, certainly see more over the next few days. One thing I can say is I will be watching Thursday night to see how Tiger gets on. As you can see, I am here on the 15th hole at King's Barnes. This is part of our nearest the pin challenge. We're running for members and guests all the way through up until Wednesday the 20th of December. Nice and simple, three shots at the target. See if I can give it a go. Nearest the pin. That wasn't bad. Oh, just a little bit short there. That wasn't a bad effort, five foot. So nearest the pin with three shots to qualify. You've got to get on the top 10 of the leaderboard. I think five foot is qualifying at the moment. We've had a few great shots as well this week. Lots of custom fits and lessons happening. So if you basically have a lesson at the end of the lesson or a fitting session, we'll give you a go at the nearest the pin challenge. If you qualify for the Wednesday, the shootout on Wednesday the 20th of December, just before Christmas, we're going to be playing for over a thousand pounds of the prizes. So you will, uh, everyone that qualifies for the top 10 will walk away with a prize. Just pop in and have a go. If you'd like to have a try without having a coaching session, it's just five pounds. So uh, pop in, come and see us over the next few days. So Saturday's competition here was brutal, it was cold, it was wet, it was windy, but we were one of the only courses in the area open. I'm aware lots of course closures, I've seen lots of images locally due to the weather we've had. It's been horrific, however, because we had our course virtue drain last week, the water just disappeared straight through. Uh, it's great to see the course in such good condition despite the weather, and Greg and his team have done a fantastic job keeping us playing golf. We closed one day last week, the Wednesday, apart from that, we've been good to go. So uh, Saturday's competition was won by, let me just remember, Bob Ashworth, Dave Laver, Alan Bailey and Alan Thompson with a score of 69. Well done guys, that's a two from four stable foot over 14 holes. Uh, twos have been paid on your accounts. This weekend we're back to winter league, so hopefully the forecast is good, cold and dry for the rest of this week. I know there's a few wet showers around today, but cold and dry. I have been down to the Golf Academy this morning to see the team down there. It is a swamp, the amount of rain that has come down. So by all means, please be patient. The condition of the balls aren't going to be great down at Lytham at the moment. However, uh, we are open, we're going to stay open and we're doing everything we can to remain open. So golfers enjoy the driving range. You don't have to stand outside and hit balls in this weather. You can be under shelter. Our Black Friday offers went very, very well. We had a superb week and I can only thank you for your support during Black Friday week. What we did, we put everybody's name that spent over £100 into a draw. The draw was made this morning live on Instagram at the Academy. That includes members from St Anne's and the Academy. And Jane Peters, I believe is her name, uh, was drawn out winning £157 back uh, for her spend uh, on uh, last Thursday or Friday, I think it was. So congratulations, Jane. By all means, the team will be in touch with you. So over the next few weeks here, we've in the run-up to Christmas, we've got some great events happening at the club. We've got the Christmas party, obviously the junior party as well. We're doing a junior session in the studio for our junior members. Also down at Lynn Golf Academy, we're doing a ladies' evening Thursday the 14th of December. VIP ladies' evening, look out for that. Some great offers for ladies. Also bring your husbands down. We're going to be doing some free coaching uh, and special offers on the night. Mulled wine, mince pies, that kind of thing. It's going to be a nice event. There'll be more information about that coming soon. 
Like I've said, back here at the old links, we look out for the mulled wine and mince pie Saturdays and Tuesdays coming up very, very soon. Come and have a go at this challenge. Again, I'm going to give it another go. See if I can beat three or four foot. That was a nice strike. Just a little bit right. Oh, six foot again. I'm sure you can beat that. Well, thanks again for watching. Come on, come and have a try. Come and play some golf. Enjoy the conditions and we will see you all very soon. Oh, don't forget the Christmas draw is up and running in the pro shop now.